Hi friends, welcome to our channel Aquatic Fish Doctor. Are you feeding live bloodworms to your fishes? You know, live bloodworms is a rich source of protein. It enhances growth. It gives more coloration to your fishes, right? That's the reason why you are feeding live bloodworms to your fishes. At the same time, do you know what are the side effects of giving live bloodworms to your fish? If not, keep watching this video. You will get many information. Fish breeders use bloodworm as a rich source of protein for the development of egg in ovaries. It is given as a good maturation diet for all brooders. So these are the main reason why many people choose bloodworms as a source of food. At the same time, when you watch the beta groomers, they usually feed these bloodworms, live bloodworms for the betas. At the end, what happens? The betas will get many diseases. You may not believe it. When you see bloodworms as a whole, you are just seeing the movement of bloodworms. But inside bloodworm, there are lot of disease causing germs live in it. Because of their movement, it attracts fishes. So uh, fishes eat plenty of bloodworms. These parasites and bacteria are invisible to human eyes. It is visible only under microscope. When you give live bloodworms, you are thinking that you are giving only live bloodworms, but it also carries some dead bloodworms in the packet. When you are feeding live bloodworms, you are also feeding some of the dead ones which are present among the live ones. These dead bloodworms spread lot of diseases to our fishes. This is called anchor worm. You might have seen this kind of anchor worm in many fishes, particularly goldfish, koi carp, guppy. Second one, many fishes get digestive tract disorder. White poo is one of the common problems that occur among all kind of chiclet fishes. So the live bloodworms are the rich source of diseases. You know, live bloodworms carry a lot of disease causing germs. How to prevent spreading of disease? through live bloodworms, isn't it? What you have to do, you have to sterilize the bloodworm. You have to collect live bloodworms in a small container. You just drain out all the water. Then apply few drops of x into the mug. This x will kill all kind of parasites, bacteria, which are living inside the bloodworms. And at particular stage, you will notice that all the bloodworms seems to be dead. Lot of rinsing in fresh water to remove the residual effect of x and then feed the bloodworms to your fishes. I have shared few information about live bloodworms in this video. I hope you have understood the problems in live bloodworms and the ways how to sterilize the live bloodworms. So keep following our channel. You will get many information about a healthy fish keeping. Bye friends.